you don't need uh, five people doing business development and design. You need one who can do that, and then you need developers because you need developers to launch. Nicholas Stevenson is one half of the online phone system firma Phone. And despite his 22 years of age, he's been a serial entrepreneur for over seven years. We launched firma Phone uh, like one and a half months before we were actually ready. We were looking at each other and said, well, shouldn't we launch today? Uh, and we got clients in and we got 10 companies in in a beta uh, phase and we got so much fee feedback from that. Harry Wangberg is one of Denmark's best Ruby on Rails developers and the second half of Firma Phone. And from his point of view, it is extremely important for the developer to get included in the process as early as possible. If you're going to make a startup, you need developers from the beginning to have a product ready, uh, like, like uh, with Firma Phone. We never made any business plans, but we had a working demo, and that means a lot. Uh, if you have a working demo, you can get users and you can get traction and you can make money. So you should have developers from the beginning and as such, I would like to join stuff from the beginning and not just be hired later on. Because it's better to have something to show. After all, users are only interested in what they can see. Uh, if you're doing something in your back, uh, on the back end and you're maybe doing something hacky or something, it doesn't matter because It just has to work from the user's point of view. The user interface is the thing people are seeing. They don't, as Harry said, see the back end, they see the interface, and that is so important. And I, th I think that more than 50% of the time we have used on Firma Phone has been on front end uh, design interface and so on. Later on, when you have to like scale and get a larger develop development team, team, you of course uh, need something structured and, and uh, well functioning. But in the beginning, it doesn't really matter. It all comes down to communication. If the developer can understand how you're thinking about it as from the user's point of view, he can understand the business. So it has to be someone who, who can communicate. Um, I'm lucky with Harry because he can see both sides, but a lot of developers had a hard time seeing the user side and the business model as well. Uh, so you as, as the business guy and, and the user guy has to be very clear and, and has to work on your communication with that person. It can be hard, but you can also be lucky to find a developer who can understand you from the beginning. And the most important part? Just do it. Just get out there, just talk to people, just build the product, just do it. And do it right now.